Alright, good evening people. Okay, today you guys can see I'm back with my big bowl. Okay, very straightforward video today. Uh, I'm at Kinadaya. Okay, this ramen place, uh, I heard a lot of great things. I missed their tasting the other time. They actually voted a uh, number one ramen in London uh, by Kelly Kelly Graf. Okay, I'm here at the Paragon Outlet. Together, we'll do a giant bowl for me. And yeah, let's enjoy this ramen today. Tonkatsu base, okay? Okay, let's see how it goes. So this is the ramen that they actually customized for me. There's two types of chashu, one is the belly and one is the loin. Okay, so these are the leaner parts and these are the more um, fattier parts. Okay, a bunch of eggs and I think I got 10, 10 serving of noodles right there. This one kind of looks a little bit like the one that I created the other time. Okay, but uh, I'm not going to wait any longer because if I wait, uh, the noodle will soak out the broth. I learned, okay. So I'm just going to go into it right now. Okay, let's get started. Okay, I got a side bowl right here in case I in case I decide to use this. But I'm just gonna go in right now. Oh my god, I'm trying to eat. Okay, try it. Big bowl. Can you finish all that? <laughs> I'm trying. A ramen or? Yeah, it's ramen. The exact same thing as the regular bowl, and this is the. <laughs> this, <laughs> this is my <laughs> serving. I'll come in and check you out. In all the right. This is really very good ramen. All right, ramen video. Just a quick ramen video for you guys. Uh, some of you guys have been asking for ramen, and uh, decided to go ahead and do a little voiceover because I did not talk too much in this video, and I wanted to describe a little bit more about the food. Okay, before I go into it. Uh, just take note that I am not a food critic or like some sort of like food reviewer or like food blogger or anything like that. I am just a competitive eater. I like the fact that even though it's a tonkatsu broth, it's a very creamy like fatty broth, I'm not getting sick of the broth. It goes up very easily. Alright, so this ramen is tonkutsu broth. Okay, so for those that do not know what is tonkutsu broth, it is um, it is a pork-based broth that is cooked using uh, a bunch of like pork bones and even some some they even add in chicken. Okay, so it's like simmered out uh, into a very very rich and creamy broth. So let me just say, tonkutsu broth is not supposed to be super salty. Okay, so if you are eating a bowl of ramen and it's tonkutsu broth and it's super salty, then they're probably doing it the wrong way. Okay, this place, they balance it very, very well. Okay, so it's not too salty, it's not too bland. Okay, so if you, if you guys are like someone that, you know, fancy ramen that are very, very salty, you guys can go ahead and try like, I don't know, miso base or like shoyu base, but tonkutsu, it's supposed to be very balanced. Goodness me, you're amazing! <laughs> oh my goodness! <laughs> my head up! You're so mean! How do you stay so mean? Oh, I 
Thank you. This, this one is you straight away put into the soup one. Right? Oh, I'm not going to Okay, add a bit of that, that, that chili powder, chili flakes. To switch the taste a little bit. Yeah, I still got like five serving of noodles here. Oh, man, we got this. Okay, so another thing I want to highlight is their char siu. Okay, they, they, uh, I actually add on a blend of char siu. So that is the pork belly one, which is super super tender. Uh, it just pretty much disintegrates. I don't even need to chew. And then there is this uh, pork loin. Uh, this this char siu that is a little bit more balanced in terms of ratio. That is more. Uh, there's a nice ratio of like the lean meat and the fattier meat, which is that that one is actually my favorite. Okay, so uh, all in all, I would say this bowl of ramen is uh, very very balanced. I would say uh, you know they, they, the 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 is cooked perfect. Uh, the okay the noodles though. I've done a bunch of ramen challenges and most of it, the noodles become too soggy before I even started eating. But this one, towards the end, the noodles is still nice and it's still like perfect because they, I think the chef sort of understand uh, the fact that the, the noodles might get a little bit soggy and he cooked the noodles to a texture that is a little bit more firm. So uh, towards the eating, towards the end and everything, it's very, very, uh, the noodles maintain that very nice, uh, firm texture through, throughout the entire challenge. <coughs> okay, we're done with the noodles. Now we have the soup. Let's drink all that soup. Let's not waste the broth. I told you guys, when it comes to tonkatsu broth, I make sure I finish all the broth. I got a lot of green onions. Okay, so uh, go ahead and enjoy the rest of the video. Again, I'm at Kinadaya, the, this outlet is at Paragon, and they do have a bunch of other outlets as well. So I'll link them all down in the description below. And yeah, that's it. Uh, talk to you guys at the end. <coughs> Alright, so we're done with this. Uh, okay, uh, this one right, guys. My one, I mix in different types of char siu. I mix in the the leaner char siu and the typical pork belly char siu. Okay, so if you guys are here to enjoy their ramen, right? Okay, you guys can add on. Okay, you guys, you guys can add on the char siu as well. Okay. So uh, all in all, I did enjoy this bowl quite a bit. Uh, at least for the first. Okay, usually for ramen challenge, I would not enjoy that much because usually when I start, okay, the ramen will already be very soggy. But this one is still okay. Noodles are still al dente towards the very end. And it's still like, uh, uh, everything is warm, nice, and the char siu didn't really change much towards the end. And I really enjoy the, which, the, the leaner char siu. I forgot what's the name of the char siu, the leaner type. I really enjoy the one they put on the sides. I really enjoy that one. Uh, yeah, so all in all, uh, I'm at their Paragon outlet. They do have a couple outlets like Paliba Quarters, Paragon, uh, Marina Square, uh, a bunch of other outlets. I'll link them all down in the description. Check them out. Uh, yeah, that's it. You guys want to see a ramen challenge? There you have it. Okay, so quick short video. Uh, I've got a lot of fun stuff coming up. Okay, so a uh, quick ramen video for you guys. I hope you guys enjoy this one. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.